Good rainfall has been reported in different parts of the country and farmers have already started cultivating their fields. Farmers in the northern part of the country, including the Tukavango and Zambezi regions, are mostly planting mahango, white maize and sorghum, which are the country's main staples. We have seen some observed some activities of uh, farmers or producers starting cultivating their land. And uh, mostly in terms of the rain-fed production, which is mainly focused on white maize and pure millet or mahango. And this is mainly into the production zones such as Zambezi, Kavango, East and West, and the, the Maze Triangle. Dryland crop farmers in the Maze Triangle area have also cultivated their fields, although they started late. Some farmers are still hesitant to plant as they are uncertain about the rainfall, while most of the white maize producers also started late. Uh, to do so, if, if the, the rainfall is still promising that in the coming, within, uh, during January, we are still receiving normal to above normal, or in February, they still have to cultivate pure millet or mahango, as it's popularly known, because at least it can be able to tolerate a bit of drought uh, in terms of production. But for white maize, they have up until end of January to do so, because otherwise it's out of the, 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 the growing period or growing uh, a, a, a time that is conducive for the production of white maize areas. Despite the good showers received, Dr. Mwanzi would not predict whether farmers will have bumper harvest this year or not. What we hope is that the, the promising or the forecast that indicates that normal to above normal in the coming months will continue because at least there will be some relief in terms of agronomic production. But, but the challenge is, is that the late, pay, the, the late planting or cultivating of that is also bound to say, should there be any dry spell, knowing that we are already coming out of the, the drought uh, condition, a severe drought condition, it might lead to a heat wave that might be able to affect what has been already germinated, and they might not be able to withstand for a longer period of time. However, Dr. Mwazi is hopeful the predicted rainfall will ensure a bumper harvest which will improve Namibia's food security situation. Jeff Tashihomino, NBC News, Vendok.